And as she's walking down, this guy just clocks her. I mean, he winds up. It's a Popeye's twister punch. Clocks her. And I mean, just breaks her entire face. Fractures her face in several places. Her jaw is wired shut. Three teeth are knocked out. I mean, horrific. The cops charged her with what? Well, third degree assault. That's the highest charge. Um, you know, there was a little lesser charge for harassment, but that doesn't do anything. The fact that it's a misdemeanor, and then this wasn't bail eligible, so he walked. So now, now keep this in mind, right? He has two previous arrests. Um, one for second degree assault, where he attacked a cop. Okay. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Yes. Whoa, 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 whoa. So these cops writing him up at the precinct. Yeah. They know, because now they've done the background, mm -hmm. that he's assaulted one of their own brothers or sisters in blue. Second degree assault, obviously more serious. Correct. And, and the other charge he was arrested for was another assault. So, you know, I think it just stands to reason. This is a, you know, a recidivist. This is what, you know, he's doing. The fact that, you know, it's not considered bail eligible because they say, well, he's not a flight risk, right? He'll continue staying in New York City and just punching everyone in New York City. So, therefore... That's okay. All right. So we have to do the deep dive on yes. this. Mm -hmm. We need to be specific. Sure. What did the arresting officers charge him with? I don't want to believe that the arresting officers charged him with third degree assault because there was no intent. That's ridiculous, especially with the priors that he has. We need to go to the arraignment judge, find out who the arraignment judge is. You, you, you got to do this because to me, this is what goes on in this city all the time. Today, Eric Gonzalez should make a statement about this. We need to find out who is the arraignment judge. I don't want to hear this crap about, well, you know, oh, our hands are tied. We're handcuffed. We can't do our job. This is not a misdemeanor assault. This is a felony assault. They say it's not bail eligible. So slowly I turn, step by step, 